In introducing the webinar, I just want to remind us of the importance of science and scientists and their role in understanding how the world works. In my view, I think what COVID has done is it has reminded us that uh, even though sometimes scientists are doing great work behind the scenes, we should never forget that a lot of breakthroughs that we have today in society have come from the work of the scientists. So I think this webinar, partly to dispel the myths, but also to acknowledge the role of science in society and the role that the scientists have played. In the second half of 2019, the world received the news that a virus of the corona family was causing thousands of deaths, that its origins was unknown, and that new patterns of behavior must be encouraged in order to deal with the global pandemic. Its official name, as we know, is SARS-CoV-2, but popularly known now as coronavirus or COVID-19. I must congratulate you for having agreed to participate in this very important platform. Because what we are dealing with here is a global pandemic that has disrupted the lives of most people on our planet and the economies of virtually all the countries. Some people compare the extent of the disruptions to that of the disruption and damage caused by the Second World War. This virtual conference underscores the seriousness and agency with which the South African government is responding to the COVID-19 pandemic, which has already taken more than 2 million lives globally and about 48,000 in South Africa. Health experts have said that ending COVID-19 relies heavily on the vast majority of people getting vaccinated, yet hesitancy and myths abound. Um, if vaccinated, I think it's a good idea. Um, even though I'm um, if I'm going to vaccinate now, I'm very hesitant. Um, reason being is because um, I don't know about how safe it is. There have been rumors. We've been watching videos as Abandu, Ababenza is about to have side effects as we get as a vaccine. Mm -hmm. So I'm very um, hesitant. But then it's a good thing that it is a vaccinated the frontline workers. So when it comes to the vaccine, um, I have a, a lot of questions that are still unanswered. And I feel like um, if the government were to answer all the questions that we have and put us at ease, um, then it, be, it will be much, much easier.